Hello and welcome to the first Tattoo Design and Composition course. This is for Charles Nostalgia Leg Sleeve. My name is Andy Foe and I'm super excited to bring this course to you. I've been tattooing for about 13 years now and I've done tattoo mentorships, tattoo workshops, online, uh, in person for about the last five to six years and it's been really exciting to be able to help a lot of people and that's what I plan on doing here. I want to be able to share all of the experience that I've learned um, over the past 13 years of my tattoo career and really just be able to share it in the most dense way possible. This is going to be a real-time project, a real-time experience and it's going to be broken up over the over a period of like multiple courses. Um, this is going to be the first of those kinds and really what I want to be able to show you is the experience of what it's like to be able to go from the consultation and the creative call process to the design to the stenciling to the actual application of this leg sleeve and bring it all the way to the end. We're not gonna do this in this course alone. We're gonna work to this together in real time. Uh, so for this first course, is gonna be exclusively tattoo design and composition. What I wanna be able to show you here in this course is what it's like to go through the creative call with the client. The creative call is the process after the consultation has been done, after the appointment has been secured, now we just want to make sure that we're on the same page of the design of the tattoo that we're going to be doing. Um, then what I'd like to be able to do is the most exciting part for me is the design and composition. This is where I think I excel and where I want to really be able to show you all the little nuances of what makes, for me, a really exciting sleeve. It's not just going to be the standalone tattoo that's going to be um, visible just on a panel, but how do we make it flow and fit together on a three-dimensional surface? How do we make it wrap around the leg and have it be this exciting piece that draws the viewer of your tattoo to want to like look behind, look in front, look below, look above. How do we get the viewer to be engaged with your design? That is my goal with this course here. Um, I want to also be able to show you real, real time um, reference pulling. So we're going to work together and I'm going to go through my thought process as I'm scrolling for all my references. And also we're going to be able to look at all the different planes of the leg sleeve that we're gonna work on. And I'm gonna show you how I choose the images that I wanna use for this design. Um, and outside of this course, we're also gonna be doing tattooing as well. So if you're watching for this course, stay tuned. There's gonna be multiple courses that are coming after this. And for each day that I'm gonna be tattooing, that's gonna be its own course. I wanna really be able to treat this as if you're here with me. Um, I want this to be as organic as possible. Um, I want this to be as accessible as possible. And what I imagine um, is I've called this like a fly on the wall series. I want you to imagine, and this is what I've said before, I want it to be a fly in the wall for some of my favorite tattoo artists. I want it to be a fly in the wall in some of the best shops. I want it to be a fly in the wall in a convention. And just to be there to see what it's like and shadow the artists. I want to be able to see what it's like when they're putting the stencil on, when they're making changes, what it's like when they're sitting down and having conversations with the clients you're gonna be able to experience that all with me. So for this course, we're gonna have about five hours of content. The following courses after that, we're gonna have between six to maybe nine or 10 hours of uh, content for each course. And that's you, as if you were here, being a fly in the wall. The best thing about these courses is that you get to actually be much closer than if you were in person. What I mean by that is like when I'm tattooing, I'm gonna have multiple cameras set up and one camera is gonna be directly over the tattoo. We're gonna have another tattoo, um, another camera that's right over the tattoo tray set up and you're gonna be able to see both simultaneously. Um, I'll describe the equipment that I'm using. I'll describe the techniques to the best of my ability and I wanna be able to show you what it's like to go from beginning to end of this tattoo. Um, outside of that, in between these courses, I wanna be able to have a dialogue with you guys so if you're watching this uh, please feel free to shoot me a DM send me messages and all of these courses they're gonna be broken down to modules these modules are important because they're numbered and we have so much information on there when you're having a conversation with me or another artist that has watched this course uh, reference back to this module number so that we can see in which video in which minute which hour is it that we need to look for and like talk about a very specific technique um, this is an experience, this is a project, and I plan on doing a lot more of these, so if you have any questions or suggestions during the time that we're filming this, uh, right now we're at September 26, 2024, um, and this is gonna go on for about four to six months. Charles has committed to come around once to twice a month, 
and we're going to be filming and recording the entire process. If during this time it's live and I'm going to be working on this tattoo, you have any questions, suggestions, or feedback, send them over. Um, if it's past that time period, feel free to send them over as well because I love being able to like get your feedback and implement. Um, one of the things is we always have to be adaptable as tattoo artists. We have to always have a beginner's mind, be willing to take in new information, also be willing to take critique. So with all of that, uh, I'm happy to share the next part of this module, the, this next part of this course for you. And um, let's just get right into it.